Hey everyone, it's Coaster here. Here's my new badge. This is the current progress that I have made on the head so far. This is my first time ever making a foam head. This is a foam head base, bucket head style. You can see all the carved marks and such. Not the most smoothest foam as of yet, but it will be once it's ready for furring and such. So there's that part. As you can see that the right side here, or technically it's the left side, is more refined than the other side, which is still in its rough block stage. But it's coming along. It is coming along. I've had to add foam, take away foam quite a few times to get it this close. But I do think it's getting there. Definitely do. And there, of course, is comparison. Compare the two. Of course, this does not have an open mouth, but I just figured I'd go ahead and make it an open mouth anyway. Let's see. Hmm. Definitely could use a little bit more shape there at the top. Curve that in a little bit more, but I do think this is going to come out quite nice when it's finished. Got all the furs I need, all those colors, and this is already measured out for the proper size, of course. So this is going to look pretty nice when it's all said and done, I hope. I'm definitely hoping. Here's a question, though. Here's a question for you, the viewers, and that's this. I'm looking for an option to use for the eyes. I've seen some people use these. These are painter's cups. You can visit a craft store. They're not expensive. They're little plastic cups. They cut out the base. Usually they'll dremel it out or whatnot. And then they'll take their buckram and then they'll apply it to the back. This is a very nice way to get that perfect 3D illusion without a rough seam that you may get with a foamy. And then, of course, there's the traditional foamy. That's what people sometimes use for the follow, follow me eyes. So before I was actually going to, uh, before I'm actually making the eyes, I want to be sure which method to go with before I try that. Here's a paper cutout of what the actual size of the eye should be. So just for comparison, got an eye there. A drew on the back since I don't have a duplicate. So then you have an eye there. There you go. All right, there is that part right there. You can kind of see there. It doesn't have a follow me effect because it's not assigned to an actual foamy or anything as of yet. But uh, just a, your input on this would be fantastic. So thanks for watching, everyone. Have a great day. Bye for now.